Hi guys, it's Colette, and today we're going to be working on this tea leaves water marble. If you love nail art, be sure you're subscribed to my channel, my simple little pleasures. And if you'd like to see how I did this, just stay tuned. Starting out with clean dry nails, we're going to begin with a base coat. Today I'm using Hollow Taco Peely Base, and you can use whichever is your personal favorite. For today's water marble, we're going to be using four of the Hollow Taco Tea Creams. The magenta is High Tea Hibiscus. The teal is Bring Me the Teal. The more maroon shade is I'm Over Brew. And finally, we have Butterscotch Hop, which I'll also be using as my base color. Once I've got my base color fully applied, I'm going to be protecting around my nails with liquid latex as well as tape. As usual for a water marble, I'm working in a 5 ounce paper cup filled with room temperature filtered water. And I'm going to be building this bullseye using 12 drops of polish. Once I've got the bullseye complete and the polish has finished spreading, I'm going to go ahead and start drawing in some petals. Also make sure that the bullseye is anchored to the side so that it doesn't move around. And once I've finished with the petals, I'm going to pull them out at the tips to give them a kind of pointy end and add to the leaf vibe. Make sure to give a final dip or two in the center to make sure things are as neat as possible there. And then I'm going to be doing two dips per hand. I'm going to be dipping my middle ring and index together, and then I'll be dipping my thumb and pinky together. I'm going to go ahead and use a tweezer to remove my protection and then I'm going to move on to the rest of my nails.
I'm going to clean up around the edges with a Q-tip and then with my usual small brush dipped in acetone. And once I've finished with that, I'm going to go ahead and press any bubbles flat. Once the cleanup is complete and all the bubbles are pressed flat, I'm going to move forward with top coat. I'm going to smooth everything out first with a glossy top coat and I'll be using Sesh Feet. And then I'm going to be mattifying the whole thing and I'll be using Hollow Taco Matte Taco. So here's the finished manicure and I really love how this turned out. I think the pointed edges really help with the impression of leaves, which is perfect for this collection, which I did receive as PR. And although I'm usually a fan of a glossy finish, in this case I think matte was definitely the right call. If you'd like to see my first thoughts on the collection, as well as the testing and extended tutorial for this design, that will be up here on YouTube shortly. And if you'd like to join me live for nail art, you can come follow at twitch.tv slash ColetteMSLP. I'd love to know what you guys think of this down in the comments. I hope you all enjoyed, and if you did, I hope you'll leave a thumbs up. And of course, as always, thanks for watching.